Hello my dear friends welcome back in the previous lecture we discussed about the extensor corpi ulnaris muscle now let us discuss about the extensor digiti minimi extensor digiti minimi it it will cause the extension of your little finger this digiti minimi right it is a muscle of forearm extensor digiti minimi is a long slender muscle right you can see in this diagram extensor digiti minimi it is located in the posterior compartment of the forearm you can see right this muscle and where does it arises it gets its origin from the lateral epicondyle of the humerus this is the lateral epicondyle of the humerus so it gets its origin here and it inserts in the extensor expansion of the digit number 5 extensor expansion of the digit number 5 so here you can see this is a long muscle and it inserts right there right so this is the insertion point now what is its action at metacarpophalangeal joint 5 finger extension it will cause the finger extension right this is extension so it comes in this way extension extension like this right so there is the extensor digiti minimi muscle it is supplied by uh, oxygenated blood comes from the mm, radial recurrent artery and anterior interosseous artery and posterior interosseous arteries all these help in blood supply what is its innervation it is innervated by posterior interosseous nerve posterior interosseous nerve right so this was about the digiti minimi once again it's a muscle of posterior compartment of your forearm it will cause the extension of your small digit or digiti minimi it is inserted in the lateral epicondyle of, or, or it arises from the lateral epicondyle of the humerus and then it inserts in the uh, digit number 5 it is the extensor expansion of the digit number 5 it is supplied by radial recurrent artery interosseous artery posterior interosseous artery and it is innervated by posterior interosseous nerve so this was about the extensor digiti minimi i hope you like these lectures friends i have told you that we will we will we will try to record all the muscles of the human body the skeletal muscles of the human body and about each muscle i will record all these six or seven points which are very important in their location along with their diagrams and we will prepare the pdf of these notes if anyone wants you can text us we will provide you the pdf of these notes so see you guys in our next lecture there we will discuss about extensor carpi radialis longus till then bye bye